everybody. Welcome to another episode of Bourbon and Booze. It's Monday again, and I'm by myself. I actually am enjoying this. It seems like you guys are too, so uh, this is a lot of fun. But I am by myself again today. Uh, everybody's home, safe and sound, I hope. My wife's about ready to be on another trip, so she's going off without me. Hopefully she'll come back with some things. But we are... Uh, going to be looking at another coffee liqueur. We've done a string of coffee liqueurs or coffee whiskeys um, over the past few months and it's because we're just overrun with them. I think the last time we did one was probably about three weeks ago. It was a coffee whiskey um, from Samuel T. Bryant, which was so good and syrupy. Uh, Cody likes to use it in cocktails now. But we're looking at Rocktown, Rocktown coffee. Uh, liqueur and we've done some rock town i think we have a couple more rock town um we did a bourbon cream i believe we have um a whiskey and possibly a rye uh, and there seems like there was one other rock town that maybe we have done but i think we're coming up on the whiskey to do so this is rock town which i believe is in tennessee right uh does not say it does say it's made with Guatemalan coffee beans. Oh, Arkansas from Livia's Arkansas. Yeah, cool. By the Rocktown Dis uh, Distillery. Uh, the price on this is really quite reasonable or maybe just average for liqueur, a uh, coffee liqueur, uh, $21.99. Uh, proof is 20% or yeah, 20% or 40 proof. So mid-level which hopefully doesn't mean that it gives you some sort of acidic bite or alcohol bite if you put it in coffee which i'm not a big fan of but we'll see um no age statement now i haven't opened this so i don't know if this is a cream liqueur or a syrupy liqueur let's see Woo, missed that one Okay, syrupy liqueur. So a nice coffee liqueur to use for um, cocktails. Ooh. Yeah, very strong coffee um, Arabica bean. Not bitter, but that chocolatey, earthy, um, almost fungal notes that you get with coffee it smells really good doesn't seem to be as thick eh, it's pretty thick as that uh samuel t bryant oh wow so not as as syrupy thick as that samuel t bryant um which was fabulous by the way but this is really good nice coffee flavors notes no bitterness i could put this in coffee i don't know why i would but i could put this in coffee but this is going to make some excellent coffee martinis oh yeah this is fabulous i think that if we barrel scaled this this would be a five this is really good i like this i'm gonna have to see if i can get it locally i bought this in arkansas mm. i need to do a coffee liqueur um comparison we need to get some mr black i think we have some carnita now carnitas is that what it's called um i forget what the name chris christiana's i don't know uh we had some of that we have quite a few of these coffee liqueurs and coffee whiskeys we can put together and do a what's best but i'm thinking this is probably a close winner if not the winner very good slight funky aftertaste but not too bad <laughs> uh, yeah this is a winner um you can see what cody and my wife think because they might um disagree with me or they might fully agree with me but that's not important. What is your opinion? Have you had this before? If so, leave a comment below. Tell me what you think about it. Um, can you get it in your area? But this is really, really good. I like this. 
it's over in our coffee section and probably gonna move it back into the bar because it's not a cream we'll see I next Monday we have scheduled a cream and we can tell the difference so um, but tell me what you think make sure you hit that like and subscribe it means so much to us check out Instagram Facebook Twitter TikTok, and all of our merchandise and tune in for on Tuesday for uh, whiskey tomorrow and then Thursday and uh, yeah I'm trying to think is there anything else Tuesday Thursday whiskeys of course coffee on Friday or Wednesday and cocktails on Friday but I don't think there's anything else. I am going to be going on another brief um, kind of long weekend outing, but it's out of the country. So I'm really excited to see what I can bring back uh, from that trip. As um, you will find out, our last trip was still within the United States. Um, so there wasn't a lot of um, cool stuff I could get. Um, hopefully there's some cool stuff, but uh, or you'll think it's cool. We'll see. But I don't know. But this next trip is just in a few weeks, so hopefully. Um, make sure you do hit that like and subscribe. It means a lot to us. Uh, check out Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and TikTok and merchandise. I don't know if I said that anymore. Um, coffee got me sidetracked. But have a great Monday, and we'll see you tomorrow for Tuesday Whiskey. Cheers. That's good. <laughs>